Dear Clara, first let me start off by saying happy wedding day. It has finally arrived. My sweet Erin, if you're reading this letter, that means our long-awaited wedding day has arrived. I can't accurately put into words how excited I am to finally marry you. Words cannot begin to describe my excitement. Clara, as I look back over the course of this year, it is evident that the Lord orchestrated all of this. We've prayed over this day, planned for this day for a very long time now. It's here. I'm so excited to finally see you walk down the aisle in that beautiful dress. I just know you're going to be the most beautiful bride. You're a dream, and it's my greatest joy, delight, and honor to marry you. When I began to pray for my future wife, there were a few things in specific that were at the top of my list. First, does she love the Lord? And Claire, that is evident, that your heart is to serve and to honor Him in all aspects of your life. You constantly encourage and challenge me in my walk with Christ. You're kind, gracious, genuine, intentional, selfless, encouraging, supportive, and so much more. You point me right back to Christ each day, and for that, I couldn't be more thankful. And the second thing was, does she love my family? And the answer to that is a resounding yes. Clary, you are my biggest answered prayer. You're my encouragement, my voice of reason, and so much more. I promise to serve you, support you, encourage you, and cherish you as long as we live. I will choose you always. Praise the Lord for His divine providence and faithfulness in bringing us together. I can't wait to marry you. Now let's get married and go to the mountains. Let's get married. I, I love, love you. you. Claire Mary. Mary.